Ratchet, it may not be with the forge or the Omega lock, but we're gonna find a way to get our planet repaired. After returning from his mission Smokescreen and the rest of the Autobots took a break with Smokescreen typing his field report. When the Autobots detected an Energon source, Smokescreen accompanied them and during the battle he managed to cleverly trap a Viacon in a rock. He eagerly joined the Wreckers in the searching the mine with Smokescreen being paired with Bulkhead. The two searched but found nothing. When Ultra Magnus got his new claw, Fitted Smokescreen attempted to lighten the mood by stating it would become signature weapon which he compared it to Bumblebee's voice box, accidentally insulting him in the process. The next mission to stop a raid failed but Smokescreen witnessed Soundwave shot down. He and Bulkhead were assigned to guard Soundwave who was rather cautious of his look. After Ratchet informed Optimus, Smokescreen assured him that they would find a way to restore Cybertron. Suddenly Laserbeak burst in and opened fire on the Autobots, only Smokescreen showed common sense and returned fire, where he managed to damage Laserbeak's wing before Soundwave rebooted and knocked him offline. Upon regaining consciousness Smokescreen found out Ratchet's disappearance. Smokescreen was disappointed where he noted that he could have saved Ratchet, if his shot had been more accurate. This was proven wrong as Wheeljack found out that the part he shot off Laserbeak was his transponder which would prove useful in finding the nemesis. Later RC and Wheeljack complimented him for his aim. They launched the probe carrying Laserbeak's transponder and monitored it and Optimus's progress from the base. Although the probe was destroyed by Starscream, Ratchet was able to send them the coordinates to his location. Immediately Smokescreen and the others geared up in preparation to storm the warship. Smokescreen brought his phase shifter as well as acquiring a new mechanical bow and then departed to the Nemesis via ground bridge with the others. During the final battle stealth team was assigned to secure the Omega lock. However, Smokescreen witnessed Megatron carrying the Dark Star Saber with him, but was detoured by RC. Concerned for Optimus, Smokescreen separated from his team in order to retrieve the Star Saber with the intention of bringing it to his leader. He succeeded and swiftly rushed to the Omega Lock control room thanks to the phase shifter. Before he could pass the Star Saber to Optimus he was blasted by Shockwave. Like all, Smokescreen was dismayed at Bumblebee's death, shouting at his comrade's demise. When the Cybermatter resurrected Bumblebee, the scout killed Megatron handing victory to the Autobots. Smokescreen was very surprised. Later Smokescreen was present at the activation of the Omega Lock to finally restore Cybertron. Back at the base before departing, Smokescreen, Wheeljack and Ultra Magnus mutually saluted Fowler and then passed the space bridge to their brave new world.